Hey, you guys. Where's your brother? Oh, what? Hey, what are you? Oh. What are you doing? What the? Do your own stunts? All right. Hi. Right on. Want to try that again? Hey, you guys. My camera here with Matt Flash Dastic. The one and only. On the, the Xbox, Xbox Live. Live. Wakanda forever. That's right, everyone. Welcome to another Jam Core Review Show where we unbox and review the things that you love. Yeah. And on today's epic episode, we do the Marvel, Marvel Collector Corps. <laughs> Did you guys forget? Yeah. That's right. For the month of February. And the theme is... Animal Instincts. Now when I think about Marvel and Animal Instincts, I automatically think about Wolverine, Beast, Sabretooth, King T'Challa, Black Panther, I think about Kraven, who else? Rocket Raccoon? Yep. You guys ready to get into this box? Yeah. Excellent. Now in each one of these boxes we typically get a shirt, a patch, hopefully a pin. Pop. So, sometimes two pops. Who wants to do the first item? Ooh. I think you did it first. All right, so go ahead, buddy. Oh. What do we have here? Oh, we got a Rocky Raccoon. Oh, it's a Rocky oh. Raccoon, pop pen, and notepad. Oh. That's actually pretty freaking cool. Yeah. Tell me about the pen first. I like how it says Rocket, and it's really cool, and I like how they have a pop logo. Mm -hmm. I also like the record, the mini Rocky Raccoon pop on top of the pen mm -hmm. and I like how they give us a Rocket Raccoon notepad. Normally I'm not a fan of the notepads because I think it's just like really gimmicky but the fact that it came in a uh, what do you call it a pen and pad set it's actually pretty freaking cool. Yeah. I am a fan of Rocket both uh, the comic book version and the actual version from the Guardians of the Galaxy movie so I'm a big fan of this pen right here. What I truly like about this little pop figure up here it is Pretty freaking well detailed considering how small it is. This is actually smaller than a pint size hero, so I really do appreciate oh, yeah. that. That is pretty cool. You think you're gonna use this? Yeah. Excellent. Well, you know what? Well. I didn't ask you about the paint job. Tell me about the paint job. Oh, I like it and I like how they give different like types Text. of brow. Oh yeah. And I like the detail on the nose and I like how they put like big eyes. Because mm -hmm. that's what makes it cute. And I like the fur. That's right. I like how you described the different shades of brown and the actual sculpt itself. That's brilliant. Let's go ahead. Oh, all right, buddy. Which are you going to get? I already know. This is awesome. Go ahead. Oh, oh, oh what do we have here? Chinchilla. Oh, wow. That is fantastic. Chinchilla. Chinchilla. No, not King Chinchilla. Oh. King T'Challa. Oh, <laughs> Black Chinchilla. Panther. Played by Chadwick Boseman. Oh. Fantastic, by the way. Did you guys like the movie? Yeah. It was epic, right? Yeah. I absolutely love the movie. Action from beginning to end. Funny. That is awesome. Oh, what, uh, what do you think about suit. this wacky wobbler? I think it's awesome, and I like the arms, and I like that you can move the arms. Can you? Let's try it out. Because, of course, Funko Pops are not articulated, meaning you can't move... Uh, arms or bend the knees or anything like that. No, it doesn't look like you can. But you said something interesting, Adrian. You said that this was the new suit. Actually, it's the existing suit from Civil War. Civil War. That's right. But uh, tell yeah. me about the paint job, buddy. I think it's awesome, and I like the lines, and mm -hmm. I like how they made the 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 texture. It's called texture. Texture. Yeah, it almost matches your suit. That is fantastic. Tell yeah. me about the sculpt. I think it's awesome. I like uh, the claws, like really small detail to mm -hmm. the claws. And I like the, what's it called again? Well, that's actually a, a pendant or decorative necklace, but it actually houses his suit. It, yeah. The suit has like this like awesome nanotechnology where when they activate it, the suit just comes alive. That is yep. absolutely brilliant. You know what I love about this? I don't know if he's about to launch into battle or if he just landed that is actually pretty cool uh who is your favorite character other than black panther uh the enemy and the girl who makes his suit okay so his sister zuri and eric killmonger were your favorite i love mbaku and you said your favorite was black panther right excellent all right mm -hmm. here we go you know what i'm gonna go ahead and get the patch before this shirt here we have oh, oh. squirrel girl that is pretty cool this patch 
It's pretty awesome. This patch is amazing. It is highly detailed. And also, it almost looks bigger than the normal patches that we get. And what I love about it is that it's so animated. Yeah, and I like how they change where they put Marvel Collector Corps because it, it's always on the bottom. It's always on the bottom or the top right here. You're absolutely right. They incorporated the logo into the patch. I like that the stitching is clean. Mm -hmm. I like the, the boldness and the contrast of the different colors is phenomenal. The only thing that I really, really wish, and I kind of waited for this the whole entire time that we were collecting these boxes, a Wolverine patch would have been phenomenal in this, in this box. It would have been epic, Yeah. but not too bad, not too shabby. Guys, it is awesome. This is 80s lure right here. It is pop, no pun intended. It is cheesy, it is corny, it is Howard the Duck, oh, private eye, private detective. Yes, oh. absolutely. Howard the Duck, of course, he has a cameo at the end of Guardians of the Galaxy Part yep. 1. Voiced by Seth Green, actually. So this is awesome. I love the, almost like the noir type of design. It's, it's shadowy, it's mysterious. I absolutely love this shirt. I can't wait to wear it out in public. So. Moment of truth. Ready? The pop. Because this is where it's at. This is why we collect these boxes. Three, two, one. Who is it? Rhino! Oh! oh my god. That is awesome. Wait, he's an animal. That is fantastic. Well, yeah, Rhino is an animal. The, oh my goodness. One of the all time Whoa. best cartoons, and not just my favorite. We could all agree, one of the all-time best cartoons in the history of cartoons, Saturday morning cartoons or after school cartoons, was the Spider-Man animated series. Phenomenal. Wow. Amazing. Uh, you know, other than the X-Men, of course, that came out around the same time, and the Batman animated series, those three are the trifecta when it comes to comic book related cartoons. And this wow. beast of a pop was one of the main villains and he is ferocious, he is amazing, he's ready to fight, and I am in awe of this pop. I thought my favorite pop from the Marvel line was going to be the Green Goblin. No, it is this pop right here. Tell me about the color scheme, buddy. I think it's awesome, mm -hmm. and I like the... The ivory horns. And I also like the color on the gray. On the suit, right? It's pretty epic, right? I love how textured it is. Tell me about the mold. I like it and I like how it's like... like Multi-layered? Yeah, and are these supposed to be the eyes? Well, he's supposed to wear like this uh, rhino outfit. So yeah, they're supposed to be just for decorative or to represent oh. the actual rhino, but he sees through his face. Oh, that's cool. And I like the wrinkles yeah. close to the eyes and I like the detail on the on the heart. I like the wrinkles and like the texture? Yeah. It's all yeah, it's, it really does represent like uh, what rhino skin would be. And you don't see that at first glance with the box, but you see it here. So that is truly just I'm I am I'm in awe. Fantastic. Overall, what do you guys think of the box? I think it's awesome. Mm -hmm. And I like everything. Okay, what about you, buddy? I think this was on point, and I think they could have added like a little bit of articulation to this, but this was awesome. But the thing that should have been switched out was this. Okay, okay. So maybe keep the pen, and instead of the pad, add a pin. Yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. So what would you give this box? Uh, five out of five. What about you, buddy? Uh, four out of five. Four out of five? I'm gonna go ahead and give this a five out of five. Just. This pop just, it's its everything. What should we use as a means of grading? Excellent. So we're gonna go ahead and give this five, five out of five, five rhinos out of five. five. You guys ready? One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five, five out, of out of five. You have anything awesome to say to these people out here on YouTube? Yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And don't forget to comment below. That's right, everyone. Go ahead and hope smash, smash that subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so you know when we upload a video. And thank you guys so much for your support thus far. You guys are truly amazing. You guys ready to disappear?